amounts of visa and travel complications, the band finally arrived in the U.S. As soon as we met them at the airport, it was clear that the entire group felt a real sense of purpose surrounding this trip, and they took to promotion of the film and their music immediately. Each day was filled with impromptu performances, and the All-Stars were eager to share their story and music. From Nashville to Knoxville, Atlanta to Miami, the band quickly gathered fans and friends. I remember the starting of the group in Simbakunia. I said, now the group has become truth. And when we come to Miami, I think we find Miami as a paradise. Now, Ruben is a hard work. We try by all means for this particular program to come successful. Did well for us. I come with my culture from Africa. And I see the people of Africa. When I have some people calling me, Franco, Franco, I say, hey, how come these people know my name? They say, some answered me, I've seen your film. Then I've seen your film, then I know that you are Franco. You bubbling, you double. You bubbling and you work like machines. You get a lot deep for material. Very linear thoughts and so on. A rasta never take a part in a violent a Rasta never take a part in a criminal idea. The last stop on the tour was Austin, Texas, where both the documentary and the band were to be featured at the South by Southwest Festival. This would be the Refugee All-Stars' first real concert in the U.S. and represented a big opportunity for them to launch an international career. But they would be one of thousands of acts vying for the audience's attention. We had never seen them perform for this type of crowd before, so it was anybody's guess how they would be received. God will help us to develop ourselves with oneness and understanding. Everything will go well. But without understanding and love, we cannot develop. When we love ourselves, I think there must be peace. And peace will get development. Yeah. There are over 20 million refugees around the world. We can only pray that they would be as resilient and their hearts filled with the same joy as our next act. Please give a big welcome to, from Sierra Leone, the Refugee All-Stars. to me to see your guys dancing our music 
So I just felt um, I'm a diploma actually, representing even the, the, the whole world, not even my country. I feel like representing the whole world, yeah, because of what I have done. You are the best, you run out, you are the best. You are the best, like the church, you are the best. Before the tour had started, we were in contact with Mike Kappas, a San Francisco-based booking agent and manager who had expressed interest in working with the band. As soon as I saw the film, I was knocked out. I thought, if we can be of help, we've got we've to do this. We had taken on the group based upon what we'd heard on record and what we'd seen in the film. When they showcased at South by Southwest, it was great. It was a relief and an inspiration. Great to know that not only is it an incredible story, but it's a great live band. I'm really honored to be part of the All Star story.